welcome to Chai with Lakshmi. This is my new garden and I'm all set to do some composting. Fact is, I don't know how to compost, so we've got a special guest, Vani Murthy, coming on this show today to show us all how to compost. Vani also tells us why we should be composting as urban Indians. Vani, could you please tell us what composting is? Composting is a breakdown of organic matter. So in the natural world, it happens naturally. But when I talk about composting, it's about our kitchen waste, that we break it down to become good nutrient for your plants. If you look at Bangalore, you know, it produces around 4,500 tons of garbage on a daily basis. It goes to the land dumps and actually it is contaminating the soil, the atmosphere and the, uh, you know, water, everything. So we have to become sensitive to that. So in the urban context, uh, if there are things that individuals can do uh, to contribute positively in decreasing the problems that urban waste creates, what would they be? 80% of what we are throwing out is, can be recycled. We can actually start segregation at source and keep our you know, dry waste away from our wet waste. We can recycle our wet waste by composting and all our dry waste, almost all of our dry waste can be recycled. So we have to start looking at value in what we throw away. So what is composting? How do we go about it? Composting means you are actually saving the environment of uh, hazardous, uh, you know, you know, when the composting happens anaerobically, a uh, lot of methane is, uh, uh, you know, into the air, the lichen that forms goes down. So imagine heaps of uh, mixed waste rotting in some land dump. Instead of it going, loading on to the municipal waste, we can actually divert it to recyclers and compost at home. And once we do the composting at home, what can we do with the end product? The end product is for the plants. Today, with the so much of contamination, people are looking into organic, you know, uh, vegetables. So you can have an even if you have a small balcony, you can grow your own, you know, basic things with your the compost that you create. So we are in my garden, and you're actually here today, um, you know, out of your own goodwill to show me how to compost. Um, so are we set to go? I would love to show you that. Thank you. Let's do that. Yeah. This is the kamba. It's a pot, three pot system. Uh, it's made out of terracotta and uh, very suitable for you know smaller homes. This is easier to manage because you can tuck it into one corner of your garden or your balcony mm -hmm. and you can actually uh, compost in this. You start off on the first pot which is empty and Lakshmi has kept all her kitchen waste separately. There's no mixed waste and I'm very happy about it. So, Thank you. <laughs> so, because I got clear instructions yes. that I had to put orange peels and banana peels yes. and vegetable peels and eggshells. Yes. Tea bags and coffee waste. So all that's so here. Eggshells are a little tough to break down. Uh -huh. So all you have to do is crush them well and then you can put them into it. Okay. So it's all your, you know, mm -hmm. uh, peels mm -hmm. and then your vegetables. Everything can go into this. The process of actually converting this is very simple. Uh, we take enough dry leaves, put it into this. So you take a rake, you can take a broken stick or whatever, give it a nice turn. The breakdown will start. But we need to, you know, enhance or hasten the process. So what we do is we'll add a little bit of bioculture. You can uh, either add a little bit of done compost. Mm -hmm. Suppose you find some leaf mulch or something, just add a little bit of that. Just or, a little bit? Yes, a little bit. Okay. It just needs introduction of the microorganisms. Even a little bit of buttermilk. You can add a spoon of buttermilk. Okay. It will start the process. So the breakdown will start. You just have to turn it around probably layer a little bit of leaves on it so that you won't attract too many insects close it leave it again the same process next day once it starts to you know two three days in uh, we need to turn the pile so that we are introducing air into it so when you say composting if we are talking about aerobic composting that we need air we need the uh, fresh waste which is the nitrogen part we need the dry leaves which is the carbon part and we need moisture there should be enough moisture so the breakdown starts and ultimately it will break down to that so once this is filled it's very difficult for you to turn it around so what you do is take this part into the middle side so this you just ah, have to lift this okay. and bring so the middle one on top okay. yes and then you start piling in this by then the the first part would have like 10 15 days it would have reduced in quantity so you can then put it in the third. So you just keep rotating. 
so that you know you have enough space to put it on a daily basis so now this this set of kamba mm -hmm. right are going to be in my garden which doesn't have a roof what happens when it rains is are, are these okay you, the way they are you need to protect them if it rains really heavily you could put a plastic cover over it okay. because we don't want too much water getting into it the okay. problem will be if there is too much water then there will be com it will compact and air won't go so you'll not have smell you can have your fr friends you can party in this area and the kamba can be in that corner and nobody will ever know that something you know breakdown is happening there maybe 40 days 30 40 days you get good product like this this is the compost it's uh, you can't see any vegetable matter here it's yeah. all broken down and it smells wonderful because it's earthy and it's moist and wow. excellent nutrient for all your plants once you start composting i i i don't think i can ever st stop because the past 2 years i produced so much of compost in my home that i gift it away to people who need it and i use it for my own plants so thank you very much vani uh, so there you go composting is something simple to do and something you can do in your apartment or home balcony or garden this is my garden and i think i'm all set thanks to vani thank you so much thank you for joining us on this episode of chai with lakshmi